Professor Ao, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, good evening. Um, it is my great pleasure to be able to join the gala dinner and award cer ceremony of the Hong Kong Social Enterprise Challenge, uh, HKSEC. And um, I'm really happy to be able to have a chance to meet so many young and energetic faces. Uh, social enterprises adopt business models that strive to achieve a balance between profit and purpose. And social enterprises pursue social values in a sustainable way and often offer innovative and caring solutions uh, to some of our major social challenges. Um, with the concerted efforts of the government, business sector, academics, and the social services sector over the years, the growth of social enterprises in Hong Kong has been very encouraging. There are now over 450 social enterprises in the territory, serving the diverse needs of the community. And they are increasingly recognized and supported by the wider community. The government is committed to encouraging the further development of the sector. And this is demonstrated by the various new initiatives announced in the policy address and the budget speech earlier this year. Um, the government has committed to extend the enhancing self-reliance through district partnership program. And we will also introduce better measures to promote various types of social enterprises and encourage the commercial sector to take up a more active role to support their development. We will also step up our efforts in strengthening the capacity building and publicity of the sector, as well as promoting cross-sector collaboration. Um, innovative ideas and talents are the center of success of social enterprises. And the Hong Kong Social Enterprise Challenge is no doubt one of the major platforms in Hong Kong that is promoting uh, these innovative ideas and talents. Um, the government is pleased that we have been able to associate it with this competition since 2008. And we are glad to see that there are more and more um, treasury students. They are now taking part in the competition. And we are also excited to have witnessed over the years uh, over 900 business ideas for social enterprises. And uh, we are especially pleased that many of the winning teams, they have in fact turned their ideas into actual social enterprises operations. And uh, the last count is there are now still seven of them that is alive and well and thriving. Um, the success stories of social enterprises in Hong Kong um, do not stop at local level. And um, we just learned that We Do Global, the awardee of the most popular project award in HKSEC in 2013, has won the grand award of the Social Ventures Competition Asia last Saturday. Um, we do is a social enterprise promoting a racial barrier-free society. They do their work in collaboration with regional coordinators in different countries. And we know that uh, we do, uh, the fact that they have been able to win this, well, prestigious award has demonstrated the ability of our younger generation to create social impact through building up a successful business. And we know that the next step for we do is, is they're going to join the Global Social Venture Competition, which is the world's leading social enterprise competition. And I would like to take this opportunity to congratulate the winning team and to wish them every success in the next round of competition. Um, I trust that the participants of the HKSEC this year uh, will be no different uh, with the theme this year of see the need, dare to care. Uh, we expect there will be more creative ideas from the participants and that they will also turn their visions into business plans and actual operation. 
And lastly, but not the least, um, I will thank the Center for Entrepreneurship of the Chinese University of Hong Kong for organizing such a fruitful and challenging event. And I would also like to thank the judges, the mentors, and the uh, faculty advisors for dedicating their valuable time to make the event a great success. And we look forward to working with you further um, to groom our future talents and so that they, we together could achieve social purposes and to pass on the culture of love and care for our community. Thank you very much.